In preparation for a larger project I've been working on, I wanted to get some more practice with designing Opta mechanics. I've designed and built a couple of assemblies before, but I thought making a focusable version of Manamorphic would be a great test platform. So this is what I came up with. Uh, it's basically the same class as the album, but with way more bits to enable it to move smoothly backwards and forwards. It's a cam-based design instead of a thread-based one, which is easier to service down the line. Usually you just replace the follower instead of remaking the whole thread. You get a standard 0.8 mod gear for follow focus motors, although you would probably need one for taking ones too. Front diameter is 88 mil, front thread is 77, rear mount is the same as the V2 alum, although uh, it will also go up to 67 millimeters. Okay, so here we have all the parts that come in the kit. Let's put it together. Okay, so that's it. Uh, hope you follow along. Uh, oh, forgot the covering. Let's screw that on as well. Since the focus depends on the taking lens and the aperture, I decided not to put a marking on the scale, and instead just had some fun with it. When it's on the lens, I feel like it adds almost an antique touch to it. And I think it's a nice contrast with how modern all the techniques are that are used to make this thing. I was back in Switzerland after Easter, and I had some time to take the new assembly out to test. I've been using it on my Fuji GFX, along with my tiny Voigtlander color scope bar, which doesn't quite cover the format, so I've cropped in on a few of these to 1 to 1, or down to full frame 3 by 2. If you try and put this setup on a rangefinder camera, it becomes a bit silly, and you can't really see the adjustments anyway, so it's much more useful with a live view. This lens is available for pre-orders now, either as a fully assembled product or as a DIY kit. It's also available without the glass if you bought the previous version, but want to be able to adjust the focus instead. You know, it, it feels kind of sad when you can like summarize two months of your life and like to like a minute and a half of video. <laughs>